Hello everyone. Hello everyone. I'm here with Christine. We are not in New Jersey anymore. We are back in La La Land. And today we are going to see Stephanie Moore. Oh, so excited. Christine, you've never seen her in real life. You've never seen her? In real life? No. Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. Yeah. I met her um once when I was doing press for the host. And that was the first time I had met her. She eluded me during the my twilight years. I was I almost had a chance to meet her like during the Breaking Dawn um, part two premiere, but that didn't happen. Um, so this will be my second time and Christine's first and Christine's interviewing her. We're just fly hard and inside me is exploding. <laughs> so excited. And we've both been reading Life and Death. I'm about 100 pages Continue in. Continue on to West Elisa Okay, Street. we're getting Enjoy. off the freeway, so it's a little bit difficult to speak. <laughs> I, um, Where are you? I am on page 30. Because I've been reading Six of Crows because that's our book of the month and I have to finish it. Mm -hmm. um, but after that, I will just go straight away. So I'm on page 30 of Twilight. I am reading it, but it's going barely. Turn right onto North Spring Street. North Spring Street. We're we going to find as close parking as we can because we have equipment to carry. We have Christine's light back here. And I have a big, not a big, but I have a suitcase full of crap. Yeah. We don't know how light's going to be at the last bookstore. That's where the event yeah, is going to be at. Yeah, it's pretty dark for photographs, so we don't want it to look like dark in the city house. Yeah. So yeah, we're in downtown LA now. I mean, it's just, we're in the last bookstore setting up. <laughs> Yay! Wait, okay. Okay, come with me. I'll give you a little tour. Okay. Oh, here's my phone on the shelf. <laughs> They'll be closing it down at 3:30, so we can do our interview. This is like the nice curve. Area yeah, where you guys did like the. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you wanna go? Here. Go ahead. In here. <laughs> like, I mean, I could probably set up in here for the interview if we wanted to, but like, no, the light would have to be in here. Yeah, you guys can be sitting down. Yeah. Accessible. Just do the thing really quick and then like switch right to sitting. Yeah. And, um. Hey. Hey. Carmen, or is that just my imagination? Carmen! Carmen! <laughs> <laughs> I think I just saw Carmen. <laughs> I got it on the vlog. This is Carmen Seda. Hey. Hey. So close. Say hi to my vlog. Hi, Where are you go? Oh, the hole. I had to bring the camera with me. Oh it's a lot of fun. Here, let me trade. I have to pee a little bit. Uh oh. oh. I wonder if I can use their honey public restroom. Wait, are you taking the camera? Boo! Boo! Hi. I'm vlogging. How are you? I'm vlogging the Hi. experience. I'm this so is Nikki. Close. <laughs> Hello, we're all set up over there. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. It's hot it's as hell. It's so freaking hot up there. <laughs> oh, oh, this is a fan. Yeah. yeah. We're yeah. going to turn it off. <laughs> <laughs> this is too loud. Yeah. Books, 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 Swimming through books. Swimming through books. Swimming. Hello. We're in right before we're about to interview her. She's interviewing Stephanie Meyer. <gasps> and Natasha's doing all the awesome camera. <laughs> Thank you very, very much. <laughs> this is a cool little cove. Yeah, although I have Pose. like half light on my face. Yeah, 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 I get like the light. I look shiny. It's hot. So do here. I. It's hot. There's lots of fans. Oh. Oh, oh. Just got done filming with Stephanie and we're doing an intro and here we go. We're here with Andrew Sims. Hey, what's up? Owner of... 
Hypeable.com, yeah. formerly Twilight Source, <laughs> a while ago, and MuggleNet. Oh, I didn't all know the you good knew times. That. Look at this door. It's like a vault door. Oh, there's a fan in here. Oh, this is nice. It's so hot right now. I just want to be back in New York where it was cold. So we finished the interview with Stephanie. Yes, we did. It went really well. Good it job, went Christine. Well. I was really excited. And now they're starting to let people in for the Q&A, which is happening behind us. Andrew Sims is hanging out with us. Thanks for the water. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Amy's oh. here. Hi. It's this thing for Stephanie. It's so loud. Yeah, she, it's it's five o'clock. She should be out pretty soon. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is cool. Can I can use your stand? No. Hi. Okay. <laughs> this is serious now. I like it. Like I still have fun. You were the last bunch of The last. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you. Um, Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry that it's really, really hot. I'm really sorry that it's really, really hot. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, so glad to have you up here. This is the last stop at the last bookstore, which is kind of awesome how that worked out. And uh, I've never been here before, so I'm super excited. This place is crazy awesome. And uh, if it was a little cooler, we would just stay here all night. But probably not. Um, so we're excited to be here. I've got some questions about the 10th anniversary and all things Twilight. Uh, Jake is going to be our moderator, and he is the eye candy, so just please focus your cameras this way. Yeah. And we'll all be happy. So, awesome. Go ahead, Jake. Shall we? Yes. Yeah. All right, your first question. How was your day? <laughs> I don't know who wrote that, but that's very nice. Thank you. Um, it's been pretty good. It's been a little warm in the last hour or so, um, but other than that, it's been great. Good answer. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Hello, my favorite Arthur. Author? <laughs> Off and running, folks. <laughs> You've written both paranormal and sci-fi romance books. Which genre are you going to tackle next, and when do you think you'll start writing? Well, I have written a novel of another genre that hopefully comes out next year if the edit packet does not murder me first. <laughs> uh, this is a possibility. It could be really good. Um, it is a thriller, I guess. It's set in the real world as much as any like Jason Moore movie is set in the real world, you know, that sort of kind of version. Um, and hopefully somebody likes it. Uh, I had a lot of fun with it. I got to kill a lot of people. This is one of the real perks of being a writer is you get to commit murder and you don't get in trouble, although someday Someday the NSA is going to come knocking on my door and be like, we've been looking at your searches. There's a big problem here. Um, it's, it'll happen. All right. I'll do the movie. Oh, you are in it. You're in You can have all the roles. I'll be, I'll be all the murdered people. You can be everyone in the movie. It'll be great. Have you, this is a two-parter. This one goes together. Uh, have you ever thought about making Twilight TV series? And would you consider Twilight Saga a movie remake with different actors? If so, how long would it take? How long? <laughs> uh, no, I, I have thought about that because uh, I am a connoisseur of Pride and Prejudice movies. And I kind of have my own like fantasy football team, right? So <laughs> this is not going to be a popular choice. But my Darcy is Lawrence Olivier. He will always be my Darcy. Um, I saw him first. Uh, one of my first loves of movie stars was that Darcy. Um, and then, but then Jennifer Ely for Elizabeth, right? Um, and the Jane from the origin, from the old black and white version, but the Wickham from the newest version that Joe Wright did. And, and, and so I just kind of have my little favorites. And I think that's fun. I think that when the book has been retouched so many times, um, you really get to see a lot of different versions of it. And I think that's not fun. But so I think it'd be kind of cool to see a version with different actors and different directors and different locations. Maybe like some 
twisty version where they all live in a different world. You know, there's a lot of things you could do with that. I think it would take a while before we needed that, for sure. And I think that it would maybe cause a riot if you tried to do a Twilight movie without Rob and Kristen. So we'll have to wait until they're like 50. And then, then there will still be people saying, why is it Rob Edward? So you're uh, going to have to just wait on that, I think. So just like the totally normal. You would be surprised at how many different ways are spoken. Christine. Christine. Mm -hmm. yeah. Excellent. Oh my gosh. Never, yeah. never Christine Aguilera. That's who you're thinking of. Do you have your own? Oh. Hi guys. It's been a while, um, but Christine and I are currently at dinner and Christine's like, vlog the dinner because it looks so pretty. Beautiful. So we're at the El Torino Grill and I got this like sampler platter. Now you can really try their food. Yeah. Our menu. Yeah. I got the fajitas. Fajitas. I'm waiting for the tortillas. But look at it. It doesn't look as beautiful as I will take. I think it looks good. That looks awesome. I love all the red. This is really nice. Yeah. Yummy, yum, yum. That was disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> so, Hello, operator. I'm um, number nine. And if you just couldn't like me, I will it's drop okay. off your behind the escalator. <laughs> no, 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 no. There was a piece of glass, Miss Lucy sat upon it, and it went up for ask me no more questions. Ass. <laughs> you said that I like, ass. Ass. Yeah, sing that, sing that song. So, um, what did I let? I filmed dinner. And we had a really good day. We did. With Stephanie Meyer. High five for a good day. Oh. Oh. God. Yeah. <laughs> I'm wearing a Twilight shirt. This nice. Twilight LA. I'm wearing a I was there. <laughs> I was there. For oh, wait. The Hollywood show hosted that. Yeah. The twi I the twilight remember conventions. that. What are you doing? Taking my hair out because it's hurting my head. Favorite moment of the day. What was your favorite moment? I don't know. <laughs> um, probably just like meeting Stephanie. Yeah, I think so too. And like just working with her in those yeah. few minutes. Really cool. And like, oh, we were um, we were like fooling around vlogging when she yeah. was on my camera, and then they're like, "Hi, girl!" And they're like, "Oh, oh. shoot!" <laughs> did you like meet her in the corner there? Did you have to like where did you? I was back? like, "Hi!" And I kind of walked with them back before I like turned around and was like, "Hi!" <laughs> Like, oh no, and I couldn't find my microphone. I was like doing laps around because oh. I just put everything on the shelf. So there's like a million shelves. I know, I put my phone like, <laughs> oh my gosh, and then I dropped Christine's mic off the camera. <laughs> Thank you guys all for watching. Thanks for watching. There's been so many vlogs on my channel. I hope you guys enjoy them. Um, and Christine's video will be up, I don't know, soon. Mm -hmm. If not, I'm going to find me. Yeah, you know where to find her. Thank you guys all for watching. Thanks Keep for watching. Keep coming for the Uncle Fungo. Uncle Fungo all.